Hello everyone! For our next hairdo, start off by taking a section of hair from the front and then make a braid out of it. We will be making 4 sections or 4 divisions out of the hair that we have taken. As you gradually move down while making the braid, you must take hair from either side of the head as well. But this is a different type of braid. So when you move on to the next part of the braid, you must take a smaller portion from the last braid that you have done. Include this in the progression of the braid and then take another section from the rest of the head. It should look something like this. Make sure that it is tight and firm. Once you reach the bottom, add a rubber band to it. Repeat it on the other side as well. For our next hairdo, start off by dividing the hair into two parts. Then divide the upper section as well and then make a braid out of it and twist it. Then move on to the lower section, take a U-pin and then tie a rubber band to the U-pin. Make sure that the hair is divided into two parts even in the lower section and one side of it. Then take a U-pin and make a twist as such and then take a thread and tie it up to the other side and then make a braid out of it. For our next hairdo, start off by sectioning the hair into four parts. Two in the upper part and two in the lower part. Then, in the left side upper part, make a braid and loosen out the sides. You may do this using your fingers. Repeat the same on the other half as well that is on the top. Once you reach the bottom, insert it in place. Then, when it comes to the lower half, twist the hair and then make it into a bun-like shape. Divide the ponytail into many sections so that it makes it even better. And then pull out strands to give it this effect. This will add to the aesthetic appeal of it. Repeat this process with the rest of the hair as well. Tie it up in place. For our next hairdo, start off by making a ponytail and then section it into these many parts. Tie the top part up with a clip and then with the bottom part, put a reverse braid as such. Once you are done braiding the hair, tie a rubber band at the bottom and then loosen it out using your fingers. Then with the upper portion, make two more small and narrow braids and then let it loose in the front. In order to keep it in place, you may tie all of it together and this is how it should look. Thank you for watching.